Welcome back, kids. I'm sure glad everybody came back to see me again. You know what? Today I was in my workshop and a ladybug flew right into the window and I thought, you know what? I want to draw a ladybug today. I've got sparkles here and oh, look at that. She's standing on a ladybug decoration. Sparkles, what do you say we go over to my easel and you and I and the kids We'll all draw a ladybug today. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. Well, kids, welcome back to my easel. We are going to draw a ladybug today. Okay, and you know what? I just happen to have a little decoration here that Mrs. Claus painted herself of a ladybug. Would you believe that is a perfect rock? Can you see that? But she flipped it over and she painted a ladybug on there. What do you think of that, Sparkles? Oh, Sparkles is just relaxing. You know, she had a really long day in the workshop today. I don't blame you, Sparkles. Are you, are you tired? I'll tell you what, you just watch because I'm going to draw a ladybug and maybe explain a few things to the kids about ladybugs, okay? Today, rather than start with a black marker we're going to start with a red one now you know what my favorite thing is to draw don't you another circle all right so we're going to do a circle just like this there you go now that is the body you know ladybugs are our friends they do a lot of good for us. There's a little insect out there called an aphid. And you know, they cause a lot of problems, especially for gardeners and farmers. They're very destructive. Our friend, the ladybug, looks after them. Like, that's what a ladybug eats gets rid of the aphids and the crops are better for it. Our flowers, our gardens are all better. Very helpful ladybugs are, okay? So just be, be careful with ladybugs, okay? So here's the body. I think before we go on, we're just gonna color this part in, okay? And you can color it in. I'm just gonna kind of shade around the edges here. You can color that in as solid as you like. You can get it really red. You can do whatever you want because you know what? Ladybugs are all different colors. They can be yellow, they can be white. And you know, they have little spots on them. So you just color that in. You can color it in like that. You can color it in solid red. We're going to color this in red. I'm just going to shade around this area here because we're going to do a red and black ladybug. So if we take our black now, and if we just kind of do maybe a half circle up here, okay, just like that. Then we have the head of a ladybug. Now, you know, ladybugs have two wings. And we're going to go right down the center of that circle to show that this is one wing and this is the other. Now, let's take our marker and we'll color in the top head of the ladybug. All right, just like that. Okay. So you might notice when you're looking at ladybugs, there are spots on them. Really doesn't matter how many spots, they all vary. Dif different ladybugs have different combinations of spots. But we're just gonna do this very simple. We're gonna put one here. Gonna do one here, maybe one in here, 
And you know, you can put these spots wherever you want, okay? Just put a couple over here to make it look like they're on the sides. Okay? Now, ladybugs actually are insects because they have six legs. Okay, like our spider we did in the last lesson, it had eight legs. Ladybugs have six. So let's do three aside. Okay. Here we go. And there's our six legs on our ladybugs. Now, if we just come up like this, there we go. Does everybody know what these are called? These are called antennas, okay? So, let's put a couple spots right up here just to balance that out. There we go. So always remember, doesn't matter where you put the spots, you can put them wherever you like, whatever you think looks really nice. But the big important thing to remember about a ladybug, they're our friends, okay? Because they get rid of pests that bother gardeners and farmers. All right? So I think we're done our ladybug. What do you say we spell ladybug? How many letters are under there? Okay. L, A, D, Y, B, U, G. There's seven letters and ladybug is one word. Okay. So let's go under here. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and we're going to spell it like this, an L, an A, a D, Y, B, U, and a G, lady, bug, and all one word. So there you have it, kids. And don't forget, if you want to do a ladybug in yellow or green or something like that, that is fine. There are different colors of ladybugs. We just happen to be doing a red and a black one today. So when you're done, always remember, kids, sparkles, you remember what I do at the end of every drawing? I sign my name on it. All right, so that's what we're going to do now. And there you go, Sparkles. I know you like ladybugs, don't you? Because you got pretty excited when that one was in the shop today. There you go, kids. There's our ladybug. <laughs> well, kids, you know, that means I've got to go build some toys. So I just want to remind you, make sure you like and subscribe to this channel. Always be kind and always believe in yourself, okay? Be good. Till next time. Ho, 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 ho.